Well, Lost City is left with a mayor and one city council member. We're talking about Willoughby Hills now, where Mayor Robert Weger fired six of the seven elected officials yesterday. Tonight, some of the council members are refusing to step aside while the mayor moves forward looking for their replacements. Channel 3's Don Kendrick is live there tonight with the latest. Hi, Don. Hi, Sarah. Elected by the people or appointed as replacements. You said it's six of the seven city council members here. Pictures have been taken down off the walls inside. Their keys no longer work because the locks have been changed. But the resolve of their mayor has not changed. Standing his ground still in this latest episode of As the World Turns in Willoughby Hills. Linda Fulton, a fan of Willoughby Hills. I've lived here about 60 years. Linda likes sitting in on admittedly boring city council committee meetings. You learn what's going on in the city. What is going on in and the city, Linda? I don't know. Because tonight, for the first time, Willoughby Hills Mayor Robert Weger is flying with fill-in wingman Chris Hallam at the planning and zoning meeting. Hallam, the only councilman to make the cut after yesterday, Weger fired these other six. That's six of seven who've been fired. Let go. Let go. Okay. Mayor Wagger accusing them of some big words that start with Mal and reminded us of Disney's evil Maleficent. So these can't be good. It's a temper tantrum. I don't uh, have temper tantrums. It had to be done because they violated the law. It's his way or the highway. Laura Pismo is one of the six fired council members. Let go. Okay, let go. Either way, fired Pismo fired off an email to the mayor today. Surely the Willoughby Hills City Charter did not intend for the mayor of Willoughby Hills to be a tyrant. She has no clue on what she's talking about. What he's doing is fundamentally wrong. Okay, so what, what if anything, should the good people like Linda be concerned about as the Willoughby Hills world turns? I'll grab you a card. Nothing's going to change. The service will continue. So they should not notice anything. And so it kind of begs the question, is the whole council ever even needed anyway? Correct. But the mayor has a plan to still fill those six empty seats. We put an ad in paper for resumes. Someone needs to fight this fight for our people and the residents and the voters who voted for this majority on council. It's going to be fine. Sure. I mean, every dictator thinks that everything's going to be fine under their rule, but that's not how it works. Mayor, get off your high horse. Do what's right. And you know, livid and fed up, Linda Fulton will be here for the next regularly scheduled city council meeting. It is a week from tonight, and uh, it will be a week then since the mayor has made his move. But Laura, the city councilwoman you heard from, says they will be here even if they have to hold their own meeting in the parking lot. I'm Dawn Kendrick reporting live from Willoughby Hills, Channel 3 News. Hmm. All right.